So we're living in a time that is really extraordinary for backyard astrophotography. We're getting uh, phenomenal improvements with equipment, um, technology is advancing, and we're also seeing that translate into the software programs that we use as well for processing our images. Now, there is, from RC Astro, there is a new plugin available for PixInsight, and I believe there's one coming for Photoshop as well, but it is a Noise Exterminator from RC Astro. So I purchased it, and I'm giving it a try, and I'm really blown away with the results. If you've ever struggled with noise in your images, and you want a quick and easy solution, this might be the right choice for you. I was actually really surprised at uh, how good it actually worked, and uh, that was out of the box, uh, not changing any settings. So Let's go over to PixInsight and we will have a quick look at this. All right, so here is a monochrome image. This is a luminance image of the Iris Nebula. And the Iris, I see a lot of people when the Iris Nebula comes around um, in the uh, imaging season for it, um, a lot of people take images. A lot of people complain about how noisy it is. And uh, it, is a, it is a tough one. So let's have a look at how noise exterminator works in PixInsight using uh, a luminance image, a monochrome image. This is a uh, linear image, um, so I have not stretched it yet. We're going to try it on a linear image to see what kind of result we get. So I'm just going to put the auto stretch back on. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a preview window. We'll test it in a preview. I'm just going to make a preview window to initially test this. Now, like I said, out of the box, this worked really fantastic, and you can make adjustments with it. If you notice here, you've got uh, denoise adjustments and you got detail adjustments. So you can, depending on your image and your situation, you can make adjustments to fine tune the uh, noise reduction that Noise Exterminator is uh, applying to your image. But I just left it at the defaults, and they work really well. I was really impressed with it, and it didn't affect the stars either, which was really nice to see. So um, I'm going to select that this is a linear image. So I've enabled uh, linear in Noise Exterminator, and I'm just going to apply the defaults to this preview window to see what the result is. And we'll give Noise Exterminator a few moments here just to do its job. Okay, and it finished. So we can see here the amount of noise reduction that was reply, uh, applied to the image. Um, if I go back, this is before and this is after. Let me just uh, enlarge this a bit here so that you can see it a bit better. So if we really zoom in here. So this is before. We can see all of the noise. And this is after. So no, Noise Exterminator did a really fantastic job. I'm really impressed uh, with this result. And it actually did the artificial intelligence, the AI component of Noise Exterminator, did a really good job of not interfering with the details of the nebula. Um, you can see that if we look at the nebula structures here, the details in it, we're not seeing a very... Uh, big impact in terms of uh, their visibility, their their um, clarity. And uh, I, that's sometimes something that can happen with noise reduction. People get maybe carried away with it and apply too much of it and it starts impacting the actual structures of the deep sky objects that they're imaging. So you don't want that. But out of the gate, the noise exterminator process really worked fantastic and it didn't really impact the details in the nebula at all. And we can see that if we just, you know, go, this is after and this is before. And we can see that if we're looking at the nebula features here, the structures, the noise reduction is being applied very um, specifically throughout the image. So this is a really excellent result. And this is a linear image, as I said, uh, monochrome. It worked uh, very nice on it. Let's just apply it to the entire image and uh, see what the result is here. Okay, so it finished and this is the end result of the noise reduction applied to a linear image. So it looks really nice. A lot of this, uh, a lot of this uh, noise uh, has been reduced 
throughout the image and we can see that it's not affecting the stars at all it actually looks really uh, really fantastic if we go back and we just look at the stars here even the small stars they're not being affected by this noise reduction all right so we looked at how noise exterminator works on some luminance data from a monochrome camera now we're going to look at one shot color data and see what kind of results we get with it so let's just switch back over here to PixInsight and this is uh, the Horsehead and Flame Nebulae and uh, I thought this was a good example to use because um, there's a lot of good detail in the uh, Flame Nebula especially. So um, I'm just going to use the default settings again uh, for no Noise Exterminator and I'm going to apply them. I'm going to apply it in the preview here though. So we're going to look at the preview and we will just apply the default values to this preview window. Okay, so it finished up and this is the result that we get, which is again, really fabulous result. This is before and this is after. Let's just zoom in a bit. That's before, we can see a lot of the fine noise. So we can see here if we're going back and forth. So that's before and that's after. That's before and that's after. And the result is uh, very nice once again. It's a, a very good result overall. Just have a look over here and see. So here we got some uh, noise that we can see occurring and after when we've applied noise exterminator to it. So really nice. And it's not affecting the uh, detail of the, the nebulas, the structures uh, in it at all. It's uh, well aware of what is noise and what isn't. So I'm really liking this new noise exterminator process that uh, is available now for PixInsight. So just a little heads up that uh, this is now available for PixInsight, noise exterminator, and uh, check it out. Let me know in the comments if you guys are trying it out, if it's working, what do you think about it, um, is it working well, and uh, love to uh, see what you guys have to say about this uh, noise exterminator for PixInsight. Thanks very much for watching everyone, we'll see you again real soon, take care, clear skies.